I embrace boldness. And God is saying in this time, let us cry out. Let us repent while the kingdom of heaven is at hand because God says he has given us time to get it right. Because in disobedience, we bring things on ourselves. In disobedience, we hinder our own prayers and prevent God from wanting to work in us because at that moment, God sees that he cannot come in because we're not ready to be broken. We're not ready to really surrender our all to God so that he can work in us. But we have to get to that place where it doesn't matter what's going on. It doesn't matter what it looks like. We're going to cry out. We're going to fall on our knees and say, Lord, I repent. Help me, Lord, that I may not be destroying myself, that I not allow these spirits that is operating and working in me to destroy me. I may not allow the enemy to use me, Lord, that I may miss out on you, Lord, because, Lord, I want to have that assurance that when I leave here, whatever that day or year should be, Lord, that I'm going to make it into the kingdom and that nothing will prevent me from making it into the kingdom knowing that you have given me ample amount of time to get it right. And then the body of Christ, as us uh, men and women of God, all of us, we're not excused. We too have to get it right with God because we're not perfect. And there's things that we still need to fix because a lot of times we can fix things, but find ourselves when we're tested, going back to the way it used to be. And we can't do that. We have to remain changed, being renewed daily. We can't go back. We can't let the old man rise up. We must continue to walk in the newness of life. And that comes with fasting and praying, really crying out and giving ourselves to God. That God can change us. Only he can change us. Only he can work on us, y'all. Because we know that there's some things that we can't do it on our own. There's some things that we could be struggling with. We can't uh, overcome it by ourselves. But we need God always. So let us continue to repent, cry out to God, do all we can for God. Because it's needed in this time. We cannot afford to get in a mindset where we think that we have arrived because we haven't. We're still a work in progress. I love y'all. Bless tribe. Let us rise and change. See what they're living in.